And on the mound for the Blue Jays, staring in, it's the big left-hander, Hyunjin Ryu. 26th start of the season, and he ranks among the best in the American League in several categories. One and two, the count on to Mountcastle. And a swing and a miss. Got him with a changeup off the outside corner. Well, he has one of the best changeups in all of baseball, but he has to offset that with enough fastball command strikeouts. Uh, that time took the took a little bit more off of it. That's great arm speed, really fooling that batter. Another 2-2. Line down to third, and Kevin Smith is up to the task. Two down. Adam played just right, didn't they? Hayes has had some big hits against the Blue Jays this season. He's hit the ball hard against the Jays. A little unlucky hitting right there as he hits it right at Smith. And another 0 2. And he got him. Big strikeout of Arias, and the Orioles will leave a couple of men on in the top of the first. And they'll take their swings off 26 year old Keegan Aiken. From Alma, Michigan, former second round pick by the Orioles back in 2016. And he gets him. Change up and a good one. Outstanding. That's exactly what he'll need to do tonight. You see Severino set up exactly where it's delivered. You can't do it any better than that. Had to throw 28 pitches in the first inning, walked a couple. He has thrown 16 here in the second, even though he's retired. The first two batters facing the third. So again, the pitch count kind of climbing on a Ryu in the early going. Got it. Swing and a miss at a fastball. Three up, three down. Go the Orioles in the top of the second. Yeah, coming right back in again. Yes, well and done. Threw it by him. Strike three. So, a couple of base runners, but Keegan Aiken retires the last two. Is there actually a man down in the bullpen right now? Now Jansen, in his return to the roster, hits it out. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, Danny Jansen. Before he got injured for the second time with the hamstrings, his bat was a little bit better. He had a three game hit streak going. So you know it was killing him that he was feeling a little bit better, pulling that hamstring, and then having to wait around for about six weeks as he gets to wear the jacket for the first time. Stay right there, Danny. That was a pretty swing on that fastball. 2-2 on the way, and he got him, looking. Good strikeout for Hernandez down, Aiken. But Bouchette still standing at second base. Fastball in for strike two. Eighth pitch of the at-bat, and he gets him. Curiel went fishing on a pitch way outside. Back-to-back -back strikeouts after the leadoff double. There you go. Looping fly ball right field Hayes coming hard and he dives and gets there Austin Hayes flashing the speed big play there to get Aiken out of the inning and Austin Hayes has been a difference maker on defense on the inside corner Severino didn't agree but it's strikeout number four for Ryu remember I was telling you every pitch has a purpose change up cutter. <laughs> one on the outside corner one clips that inside corner gets the call from the home plate umpire starting pitching in defense. That's how you win. Swing and a miss to get him back to back strikeouts two down a couple of fastballs up for strike one and strike two then you go just a little bit further up. Maybe you can get Mateo to chase and he does. Got it. What a curveball. Ryu strikes out the side. He is getting better and better as the game moves along. Five hitless innings for Ryu. One two on the way and he got him. Two down. Well, Keegan Aiken has trusted his fastball in his last three starts. I don't know if he's throwing it as a higher percentage this start as he did his last one. Last one was 65 percent. This one probably about in line with his 57 58 percent but elevated just enough right by the back of George Spring. You got to be careful with uh, Mullins because uh, he can hit a breaking ball. This one has popped up. Ryu goes back and makes the catch. And a hint of a smile for just a moment after that play. Don't want to break the concentration. Watch it. Ball goes up. He looks. There's the shortstop. I better go over there and make the catch. And he hauls it in. You don't see too many pop-ups back to the mound. Right field. There's the first base hit of the game for the Orioles. 
Fielded by Hernandez. Here comes the throw, and he does get in with a double. So Ryan Mountcastle delivers a two-out base hit. And the Orioles have the tying run in scoring position. He just kind of insides out this ball. This ball gets on his hand, but Ryan Mountcastle so strong, shoots it right down the right field line. One strike pitch. Up the middle and into center field. Mountcastle around third. Heading to the plate, and he's in. The Orioles have tied it up. RBI base hit for Austin Hayes, who moves up to second base on the throw. There it is, RBI base hit. Runners in scoring position. A struggle for the Orioles. Threw a lot to that losing streak, and that ball just stayed down on the second baseman, Marcus Simmons. He thought he was going to come up, but 107 off the bat, and there's Ryan Mountcastle scoring. The Orioles have tied this thing up. An RBI single with two out by Austin Hayes. It started with two quick outs. It's turned into a long inning. There's a line drive, base hit into left field. This will give the Orioles the lead. Arias delivers again. Hayes is home. Here comes the second run and diving head first and safe. Anthony Santander and the Orioles go on top three to one. Guerrero tonight fly ball to deep center fly ball to deep left just missed on a couple of occasions. Now he drives one to right. And he didn't miss here. Third home run of the last two nights for Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Uh, he may be shushing, but everybody else is making noise in this ballpark. There's not a doubter in the park tonight. He's back. Number 39 on the season. Tail with third, one down. 3-2. There's the Frisbee, and it's stroked into center field. RBI base hit for Jones. The Orioles add a run. Mateo scores, and it's 4-2 Orioles. Orioles getting it done tonight with runners in scoring position. Now three for seven on the night. One for two, two stolen bases. Still run a little bit. Got him, and the Orioles win. Salser strikes out Dyson, and the Birds put one in the win column and even up this series at a game apiece.